Welcome to the Vista Acres Homestead Channel. We'd like to thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe, turn on your notifications button, and if you can, give us a like button. And again, thank you for watching. Good morning, y'all. My Aggie. She's ready to go out. We're ready to give you an update. Boy, do we have an update going on. We are excited. Well, I'm kind of excited. I got a new camera. Y'all let me know how it works out. It's a uh, AKASO, Akaso or something like that, V50 Elite. Got it off the old Amazon. See how it does. That other camera, GoPro battery thing with this. What's the bad? We're gonna let. We're gonna start off. We'll show you our big update here in just a second. But we're gonna let the let the old birds out. It's fun. Got these birds. That chicken there. Just if you can see that chicken there. Uh, don't like to go up. And that is that is a problem. Maggie's ready to run them out. Everything's off to the race. Woo, everything off to the race, Maggie. All right, let me show you the big update, y'all. This is it. This is it. Got it from Lowe's, y'all. Uh, I told you I'd made that big order. And, uh, whoo. That's going to be a lot of work to do. But, we've got everything ordered. Everything's here to enclose the carport there. Put the uh, porch on the back and put the porch on the front. We also got stuff to do the inside uh molding and all that stuff so we are ready to go with all that stuff all right there maggie oh it's a pretty sunrise this morning it's bright ain't it bright it is bright so what maggie and i've got to do is get the feed for the turkeys do the normal chores this morning any of y'all been watching a while, you kind of know how those, those go. We'll get the old feed to feed the turkeys down there. As I say, that loads is a good place to shop and a uh, good place to work. I all right, better shut this door. Y'all know what I have. Some chicken's been there eating, eating all the quail poop. Chickens, chickens, chickens. Chickens get into everything, you know? Maggie, where are you going? Where are you going, Maggie? Yep. Oh, man. Turn no water on. It's a little cold out here this morning. Hope it ain't frozen. Uh, don't seem to be. Seven day forecast. They wasn't predicting any uh, really cold weather. You know, pretty nice actually. I like it about this temperature. My old dad would say when we get up, it's good wood cutting weather. Woo!
here in Jordan. Uh -huh. And right there is a rooster. That one's probably a rooster. Of course, that is a rooster. There's a rooster. I'd get them roosters out of here. They'll kill them. I'll tell you, I was telling somebody about Brahmas, Maggie. I was telling somebody about Brahmas the other day. Uh, that's funny, that water's not pro. Uh, I was telling somebody about Brahmas the other day. And, uh, it's interesting. With people, they're very gentle chickens. Don't have any complaints. I mean, I've those free ranging up there, they're what you call a beige, Brahma. Uh, just a, a real gentle chicken. They never attempt to bother me or anything. But, uh, as far as each other goes, they're rough on each other. Matter of fact, they're all, they'll kill each other in a heartbeat. I have to keep an eye on them. They're upon us. The chickens I've got, they're good to each other. They don't bother each other a whole lot at all. I had this old uh, rooster down here. It's by himself. Uh, he was he's a little rough with the other the hens. And to be honest, they pretty rough on him. He he got looking pretty bad. He's looking pretty good now again. I got this old Brahma in here, crippled leg Brahma in here with him. Let's see. He's a big chicken for a, an Americana. But uh, him and this Brahma. The Brahma's got a crippled leg. That's one of them, that's one of them buff Brahmas. Both of them buff. Buff or not. But, uh, them guineas, them guineas, they, they know now I'll throw this food out here to them. I have to throw it, or they'll. There you go, watch it. There you go. There's one of them. Oh. One of them. Let's see how many I got there? I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's two of them. They will not let hang around. I don't know why. It's pretty mean to. Right there. I had to get her out of there. They was, if I hadn't got her out, she'd be dead right now. They was them Americans that, or not Americans, but them uh, Brahmas would have killed her. Can't keep my chicken straight this morning, can I? All right, we're dead here. Everything, everything's pretty well watered except the geese. We don't have no water coming out, so look at that. It's a working on it. So I hear it coming. I think we. It's a pushing. It just ain't did it yet. There you go. We'll try that. Maggie, help me here. Watch her. She'll help me. Maggie, help. I believe that's happening, y'all. All right, well, I'll just do that later. Let's go over and see if the turkey's got food. Guineas, see, they're mean. Guineas, are, they're mean. I threw that one for that one bird they won't let eat with them. And they'll come over and eat his food. Now they're gonna go back over and eat this food. They're mean. See that one? They won't let that hang around them. 
try to throw it some food there. And they, they come over and ate its food. Now, if it was smart, it'd eat that food right there. Guineas, guineas are not, they're not real, real smart. They're not as smart as those geese are. And them geese, geese are smart. The geese, the geese are waiting to be watered. I would say patiently, but they're probably not patiently watching. <clears throat> All right, guys, gal. How did your pond, your pond get so low? I filled it up yesterday. How'd y'all let that happen? Y'all got food? Yeah, y'all got How'd you let this happen? It ain't leaking, is it? Oh, man, what a mess. There's old geeseys. They're probably my favorite bird. As soon as that water goes to running, I'll come down here and get you some water before I leave. It's surely by 11 o'clock it'll be thawed out. You reckon? It should be, shouldn't it? I'm not gonna dump that out because you got a little water anyway. Uh, as soon as the sun gets up, this hose ought to thaw out pretty quick. We ought to be able to get this thing going. Oh man. Guinea guineas. They're mean to the chickens. They'll put some chickens on the run. Oh, wait a second. I may have found a problem. I didn't switch it up here. It may not be froze up. Hang on. See that running down at the turkeys? I got a switcher up here. Woo! May have figured out the problem. They should, might not have had to even disconnect them hoses, Maggie. May not. Yep. That's what it is. Didn't have the water on. You know what? You got to turn the water on for the water to work. I wonder why that hose up here wasn't frozen. That was. Ah. Y'all hear the water running? Geeseys? Y'all hear that water running? It should be running, yeah. There we go. Gotta turn it on for it to work. Could be a problem of uh, old age, y'all. All right. So, geese are happy. As that fills up, they'll be happy campers with that full. You can see it. Oh, Maggie, don't get on their nerves a whole lot. They don't, they just kind of ignore Maggie. It's kind of the way I do it. The geese and me are like on that. We kind of we ignore Maggie, don't we? Don't we, y'all? Yeah, get you some water. Yeah, good clean water in there now. Yeah. I see what's going on. It needs to be up this way a little more, I guess. Yeah, get you some water there. Get some good clean water there. Your bills look a little dirty. Yeah. They pretty, ain't they? There he goes.
And tomorrow, I'm going to move that thing up this hill a little bit and get some mulch to go under it there. So I got three days to work. It's kind of funny. I got three days, but only one day this week. And then the uh, uh, next two days go on next week. My day, my day starts on, uh, week starts on Saturday. There you go, y'all. We got y'all fresh water. Better be glad I figured that out. Come on, Maggie, let's go turn the water off. I did figure it out. Them turkeys, they're awfully spooky. You know, they're easy, just get all rattled and tore up. Phew. Let's go turn the water off. And then let's, uh, uh, let the kitty cats out, feed the quail. Yeah. Oh, there's a package. There's a package. That may be my batteries to this new camera. No, that blows them off. Okay. All right, let's go let the kitty cats out. And, uh, Look at them chickens standing there waiting to get in there and get to that food. Those are my lazy chickens. Should be out getting food. Maggie busted up that party. What are they waiting on? Just get in here and eat the rest of the cat's food. Maggie drinks the water. What y'all doing? Y'all doing out this morning? Fuzzy? Taylor, Taylor said, yeah, they're Lambo. They're Lambo, Lambo let me pet her this morning. Never know Lambo, sometimes she don't want to be petted. All right, better cover this feed up. I better eat that food, the chickens are waiting on it. Yeah, lazy chicken. Look at that, look there. You ever seen anything? Maggie, Maggie being sweet. Sweet moment by Maggie. Don't see that all. Yeah, what y'all doing? Huh? Yeah. Kane's happy. He can, he can see Maggie in his usual spot there, so. Now he ain't running out the, he running out the door on me. Y'all see that? He gets all excited about seeing Maggie. Right, Mama Turkey? Mama turkey, she will, she will sit on some eggs. I want to get my turkey pens built, and uh, they going at it. Aren't they? they just love each other. To death. They just love each other to death. Yep. Okay. Huh? Yeah, we gotta get those turkeys sorted out. I'm probably gonna put those hens. He's got four hens. He could probably have a couple more hens. And I'd like to put a couple hens with Kane, maybe three or four with him if I've got them. And the only problem is I don't want to mess around and mama turkey not go to sit. But she will sit. And that's pretty good. She's hatched out. She's hatched out most of these birds. Most of these turkeys here. Maggie, get them chickens out of there. Maggie. Get the chickens out of there. Good, Maggie. Just stare at them. They'll move. Well. See? Chickens. They're like football players. They got to strategically get out of the building without Maggie. But do they learn their lesson? Do they learn their lesson? Maggie! Come here. Get the chickens out of the building. They're back in there again. Get them. Yep. Yeah, get them out of there, Maggie. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. All right, come on. 
No, see, Maggie does what Maggie's supposed to do every now and then. I ain't gonna guarantee she does it all the time. I always tell Angie, she's a well-trained machine. Angie laughs. She thinks that's funny. She don't see anything trained about her. <clears throat> All right, y'all. Had to separate my two white quail there. They was a little rough on each other. Uh, quail's just like every other bird. Get a little brutal with each other. I'm gonna put the food in here. These guys got water. Hey y'all. I really like this water thing. Uh, it's good with the quail, especially when they get grown. You can't put something like that when they're babies. But uh yeah, you couldn't use this with small ones. Get in the ground. say good place to buy stuff good place to work you know? Hey, I want to tell you a little more about that camera. Uh, had two things that I hope I can correct with the camera. One of them I know I can. Uh, one of them I left the uh, it in the lens case, which is really a water underwater case, and that's I had to adjust the sound. The sound wasn't the way I wanted it. Um, I had to do that in the editing software, so I was able to fix that but the other one is a stabilization you may have noticed how jerky the camera was uh i think it was off i hope it was off if it was on that camera's not gonna work it's i, I don't like the way it was doing so uh that's a little update with the camera after i got in looked at the footage and did some editing on it uh that's those two biggest things was the sound which i know i can fix that repair that problem and the other problem was with the stabilization. And like I said, I hope that was turned off. I didn't notice, but uh, hopefully we have turned that back on and the stabilization when I'm walking and talking will look a whole lot better. But again, y'all appreciate you watching the video and, and putting up with that. Got to go in here and dry Maggie's feet off. Maggie, don't get on the floor. You got to have your feet dried. Maggie, yeah, good girl. Come here, Maggie. 
Yeah. Dry you. Maggie stays here. Hey, she's, she's a good girl. She puts them feet right up there. What? It's supposed to let you get in the mud. No, I what? No, I what? No, I what? It's supposed to let you get in the mud. And then she sees that, she gonna be like, what you let her get in that mud? Let me dry you off underneath. You might have to have a bath. Nah. I was just one for at least a day. Yeah. Oh yeah, y'all. Let me show you this floor how it turned out. Didn't really in that last video show a real close up how it turned out. Maggie. Maggie hadn't got used to it yet. She's still slipping and sliding on a little bit. Boy, really tickled how it turned out. Turned out really good. Only had one place that had a little bit of a crack. And I worked it. It was right over in here where Maggie's at. About where her foot's at. But I was able to get it worked out. And uh, really turned out good, y'all. Put a transition strip there. And uh, maybe eventually wood it. I've got some wood for it also. So pretty tickled that, y'all. All right, y'all. Again, hope each and every one of you have a great week coming up. Hope you have a really good Sunday. Appreciate y'all joining the Vista with us. Thank you again. And uh, we appreciate each and every one of you. If you hadn't subscribed, please subscribe. Hit that like button. Hit that notification button. Again, y'all, thank you for watching.